we are finally moving to the apartment. Okay guys, so we're doing the last load of laundry in the Airbnb so that when we get to apartment, well actually the reason is I don't really like packing dirty clothes. So. Okay hey guys, so we're officially moving in the apartment. You can hear Danny downstairs. My dogs are exploring the place. Oh, oh. Oh, sorry that I didn't remove your pee pad. Dogs are settling in our apartment. And Dan, what are you doing? I was going around Tacoma looking for apartments and I think I went to like four different showings. The first one was okay. I think I just got excited of the thought that I'm finally moving into my own place but when it was just a studio with no bedroom. My ideal um, apartment was that at least a one bedroom with kitchen and like my own living room space plus a bathroom of course so the first one that i went to it was the widest and also the most expensive one among the three that i saw but i didn't like the kitchen it was too small for me the second one i went to it was also very good like the kitchen was nice it had the best bathroom among the three a really nice bedroom but my problem was the neighborhood it kind of looked sketchy for me so I didn't want to live in a place that I felt I was not safe and the third one was it was just perfect for me perfect with like the interior of the apartment the environment the neighborhood it just had like pet fee pet fee was 50 each and since I had two dogs um, I had to pay f a hundred in additional to the rent for pet rent and I also had like $500 pet deposit 
but the way to bypass um, pet deposit and pet rent was to register my pets as emotional support animals so I'll link down below the doctor that I got my ESA certificate from it was very helpful I only paid like $140 for two dogs and that saved me like $1,700 for the whole year so that's totally awesome because I really wanted a space just so my dogs could like run around and yeah I mostly got a space because of my dogs Okay guys, so I'm at Costco. Um, I'm going to buy like the basic stuff, things that I need for like until I get my furniture. I'm changing my cart to a bigger one since I realized I'm buying more. said somewhere between 1 to 2? Between 10 to 2. Oh, between 10 to 2. Okay, that sounds good. So in this case, we will have to use a shuttle truck. Um, I asked, but they said they, you guys could use the 18-wheeler truck, but... Uh, depends. There's an 18-wheeler inside the apartment. Oh, I see, I see. Okay. There is no way. <laughs> yeah, I think so. It's too much damage to too many cars. Right, yeah. right. Let me uh, call the office and I will check uh, what's the price for the shuttle. Ah, uh, so the shuttle isn't free. I mean, no. it doesn't come with the... Okay. Alright, yeah, so it, you just uh, give me a call back for the price. I will give you a call back in a few minutes. Okay, sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. So basically on the system and GPS and all that, that uh, truck will not fit. So it will be, um, in the weeks, definitely require a smaller truck. Mm -hmm. uh, right How now much 500. is... Oh, $500? 500 is the remaining balance. Oh, okay. How much so is the, the shuttle? shuttle shuttle according to what I have it's 400 however um, I was basically checking with management if we could like reduce it a little bit and um, in that case we came to 300 and total will be 870 for the full payment okay well I guess I don't really have a choice okay um, question how many and everything and they told you about the shuttle and all that yeah. Okay. All right. And how are you paying for it? Um, I have a money order. For shuttle two. Yeah. Okay, I'm just making sure. Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, I think. Thank you. Bye.
My bed is already in the room. Okay, my furniture is finally here. It took about a month to move my furniture from Hawaii to Washington. So it was perfect that I stayed at my Airbnb for also a month. I wouldn't really recommend shipping furniture since I almost like paid for my furniture twice instead of like going here and buying a new TV, a new bed, I think I would have been cheaper. But I did have a lot of stuff and I went vacation to the Philippines before I moved to Washington. So I didn't really have time to sell my furniture. But overall, moving was, it wasn't a smooth road. Definitely I had a lot of bumps along the way no matter how much I planned ahead for it. But I'm happy that I'm finally here and getting settled in my apartment. I just have to put my stuff away that just came and I'm starting work soon so that's definitely very exciting. Thank you so much for watching my vlog and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!